This is our CGI we use to detect uh, and pinpoint and grade natural gas leaks. I'm going to demonstrate how to hook up the uh, probe, the gas, I mean, excuse me, the water dust filter, and the hose that hooks up to the CGI itself. First thing you always want to do is install this filter onto the probe bar. It's got some coarse threads. All you do is just screw it onto it. And you want to take your hose and hook up to it. It's a fine thread. You just want to screw it into it as well. And then before you turn the device on, you always want to hook your probe and stuff up because you do not want to draw in dust into this because it can give you a false reading or make your readings be a little off. And then when you get ready to turn it on in warm up stage, you always flip it to auto zero first and it runs through a self check. It checks the sensor, it checks the pump, to make, and it also checks the batteries to make sure everything's working like it should. It takes about two or three minutes for this cycle to run. If you'll see, it does show gas one on it. That's the sensors that it has in it. It'll say gas two for the next sensor. When it displays end, you're ready for the, to use the device. What you have to do is turn it to gas. But if it ever shows no go, then the device is out of calibration or something is wrong with it. You do not need to use it. You need to bring it in and let us service it and see what might be wrong with it. But whenever you get ready to do your bar holing, take your knob and turn it to gas. It'll run for about another minute or so. When you get a zero, all you have to do is hit your reset button one time. And when it pulls up your zero, mash your button one time, and it will display go and it turns the pump off, and now you're ready to start bar holding.